So now it's time to see if the nuclear bomb that we made using our god powers is any good. We're gonna destroy this impossible battle. Three, two, one, here we go! Join the project by subscribing to the channel and click the bell icon to receive notifications so you'll never miss another video. Hey guys, welcome back to Tabs. Today we are going to defeat these impossible battles using our epic god powers. Every impossible battle that we do is gonna get more and more difficult but we are gonna get more and more powerful god powers. So guys, stick around till the very end and now let's check out the first battle. Oh yeah, this does look pretty impossible to me. We've got these guys, the headbutters, all around us. And we need to place units in the center. But what these guys don't know is that we have the god powers. So if you guys are excited, leave a like in the video right here, right now. And after you guys have left a like, I'm gonna place down one guy. Just one. This poor little guy has to survive all of these poor little guys. Including this blue guy. Let's see what happens without the god powers, okay? Can we win? I don't think we can do that, right? No, we cannot. But thankfully, we can start the battle and immediately pause it. So over here, we've got Mr. Clubman. How you doing, Mr. Clubman? Did you leave a like on the video, Mr. Clubman? So we're gonna spawn these spears, because after all, we have god powers. Now every battle is gonna get more and more difficult. This one is not even that biggie, okay? Let's see in slow motion what happens, okay? Go! Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. <laughs> now we took out a lot of these guys. But clearly not enough. Thankfully, these are the new god powers, meaning that we can also supersize them. Check this out, guys. It's already growing. <laughs> so now we're gonna place on a spear. Oh, oh, that's a big spear. That's a <laughs> That's a big spear, all right. Can I still place him down, though? Oh, I don't see anything. Um, guys, what did I just place down? <laughs> Where did the units go? Oh, what they're hiding underneath. Oh, that's crazy. Okay, again, slow motion. Here we go. <gasps> what? No way. That's the craziest thing I've ever seen. And these are just the spears. Just imagine what we can do with bombs. Guys, this is the easiest one. We have to quickly, you know, complete this one and move over to the next one. So I very carefully placed a bunch of spears at every guy. This way we should be able to make it with just one unit. Challenge accepted. We're only gonna use one unit for this entire impossible campaign. Let's go. Is it gonna work? Oh, that's beautiful. But why did we not win yet? Hold the phone. Oh, this guy's still alive? What a madman. Get down. Get out. Get out of here. Get out of here. Stop flying. What are you doing? You are not supposed to be alive. You have like a billion spears in you. For the next impossible battle. Looks like we've got a bunch of Vikings in a town. But they somehow gave me 40,000 bucks. I don't even think we're gonna need the uh, god powers here, right? This is gonna be totally easy. What's going on over- Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. He's got secret units in the back. <laughs> I should have known. This guy is a total cheater. But guess what? We are gonna place down one unit. And I've got something that this guy, whoever made this, did not see coming, okay? You see, I have some Viking powers of my own. <laughs> That's right, I've got the ice arrows. So what I'm gonna try to do is get as many arrows in here as possible and freeze all of these losers. That's right. Actually, that might be a very bad idea. Maybe we should get a bomb in here so that we can, you know, burn them down a little bit. Oh, we can use the new fire arrow things from the spooky faction too. Guys, this is great. I've got so many ideas. This is gonna be awesome. Let's see it in slow motion. Oh, look at that. That is how you free some dudes, right? Actually, is it? Yeah, these guys are frozen. Very nice. Come on, big boy. It is time to freeze. Oh, this guy's never gonna get frozen, right? Look how many arrows are inside of this dude. Please just freeze. You know what? I'm trying to freeze an ice giant. 
and it actually worked somehow. What do you know? I know what to do, guys. All we gotta do is supersize these guys a little bit. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I gotta be careful not to hit Melvin. He's, of course, my one and only dude in this whole battlefield. Wait, what happened to the Ulnius? Hello. Oh, 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 they're still alive. Well, that is gonna change uh, very fast. Yes, yes. And in slow motion. Three, two, one. Here we go. Oh, yeah. That looks good. That looks good. We're gonna get those guys frozen. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Mr. Ice Giant, look at you. You're all full of ice arrows. So it looks beautiful, but I don't think this worked. Fire arrows. This is how you counter the ice faction. We're gonna set these guys on fire. And I've got a pretty cool idea for a nuclear bomb where we can combine a bunch of god powers. Stick around, okay, guys? We're gonna get the uh, nuclear bomb going in a second. First, we gotta show these guys how to melt some ice. There we go. Just a few more arrows, just like that. That should probably be enough, right? Oh, ho, ho, ho. this is gonna be a very laggy, I think. But in slow motion. Three, two, one. Here we go. Oh, yeah. That's more what I'm talking about. We set these boats on fire. There we go. They even go flying. Wait, hold on. Why are these guys still jumping? You're not supposed to be alive, dude. Come on, man, this uncle. Whoa, look at this guy go. Holy moly. Right, Melvin is gonna survive. The ice giants have gone down. Very nice. No, wait, hold on, hold on. Spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. Get this guy out of here. Come on, go down. Yeah, there we go. Are the Ulnias down? Yes, they are beautiful. So now it's time to wrap up this puppy. Here we go. We're gonna get rid of these guys as well. Not even in slow motion anymore. Come on, get these guys out of here. Set them on fire. <laughs> yeah, that's what you get, boy. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, that is how you win. Another impossible battle. This one even more difficult than the last one. Well, guess what? I know where your secret units are hiding. And okay, there's nothing here. What? Well, well, well. I did not expect that, but I guess he didn't expect the onslaught of my pumpkin army. You see, it's all orange and red and stuff here. So I figured I gotta color match the battlefield a little bit, all right? So I'm gonna make what I call a massive pumpkin face snake. Yeah, that is as terrifying as it sounds. We get some clam boys over here. Some secret unit from the pirate faction, huh? Let's see if we can blow these guys away. So just like the other two battles, I have one unit. And he is the protector right over here in the distance. He's gonna have a pretty nice firework show. Three, two, one. Here we go. Oh my goodness, I did not expect that. I did not expect that. Watch out, protector. No, he got hit. Are you kidding me? Well, this sure is a beautiful battlefield, but it literally backfired. What if we make it rain a few bombs, okay? I don't think I should, like, spam them like this. Maybe I should spread them out a little bit. So these are cannonball bombs. We have a bunch of explosives in tabs, of course. And we're gonna test which ones are most powerful so that we can use them to create our nuke. Because I think for the final battle, the last in this campaign, we're gonna need the biggest, most powerful god powers you've ever seen in your life. Cannonball bombs in three, two, one. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Well, that was a big boom, but are they still alive? Melvin, why are you still alive? Get out of here. Get out of here. Pirates as well. Get out of here. Is that Blackbeard? I don't think that's Blackbeard. That's just the captain. Get out of here, Captain. I'm gonna blow you up with your very own explosives. And this is the last guy. Oh, ho, 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 boy. Can he do it? Boom. <laughs> oh, ho, 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 guys. Uh, this is an awesome battle. We've got a bunch of spooky dudes, and it's apparently impossible to defeat it. Well, it would be with just one tiny little spear thrower. Thankfully, I have just the answer. We are gonna use the spookiest... Of all the god powers, these are little candle fire blows. So what they do is they fly forward and then, well, you're gonna find out what they do. It's gonna be pretty spooky, all right? But it's gotta be spooky, because he's got vampires. And vampires are totally overpowered. Three, two, one, here we go. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 
That's what I'm talking about. We're literally gonna blow these guys away, right? Oh no, the vampires! See, this what I was kind of worried about, right? The vampires, they turn into little bats. Hmm, looks like we need a plan B. So we used the cannonball bomb, which was really good with the tribal faction. Now we're gonna use cannonballs from the Da Vinci's tank. So just like the last one, I'm gonna place them down. And we're gonna see if these explode a little better or a little worse. Because we need to find out if these are good for our nuclear bomb. We don't quite need it yet, because I think this is gonna be plenty. But we need to figure out which is the best one for the biggest boom, all right? Three, two, one, here we go. And... Oh, it doesn't explode, though. Oh, it's beautiful, though. It's like a big smoothie made out of skeletons. But these things don't explode. I thought they were gonna boom, man. Come on. Okay, they do smash these skeletons, though. I love this. Is there no vampires? No vampires spotted? All right, I think all the vampires are gone. Means we just gotta get these guys out of here. Oh, that is a little bit laggy. We got a lot of dudes here. But that's it, right? What? Oh, that was another vampire. Are you kidding me? So I've placed on probably close to a million very tiny little flintlock pews. Let's see if this is gonna work. It's from the pirate pistol. Go! Okay! That was not even half bad. As a matter of fact, that was better than expected. Hey, hey, you little bat. Get out of here, stupid little bat. Oh, I don't like these vampires. I do not like these vampires. Get them out of here. And that's how you can win. This is what I call an impossible battle. It's not even the most difficult one yet. But we've got vampires in the back. We've got vampires in the front. And then we've got the reaper right over here. How can we use our god powers to defeat the reaper now we do have something called bomb and i want to see if we can get that going oh yes it's a tiny little bomb but does it explode better than the cannon one that's what we're gonna find out so we're gonna place them all around the reaper over here just like that and i should not forget about all of these vampires including this very special vampire. I can definitely relate to that guy, okay? <laughs> Give these guys some love as well. Oh, oh, wait. These guys are trying to hide. That's not gonna happen, boys. And then all of these guys. Oh, that's gonna be a lot of them. Now, I brought Melvin the Mammoth. He's right over there. Okay, well, this is his butt. But that's Melvin the Mammoth. Because I'm a little bit scared. All right, this is kind of freaky little map here. But I have to be confident in the power of the... God powers so let's see if this is enough bombs i can imagine that it is three two one let's enter darkness and okay it's not exploding oh there we go yes -hoo 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 -hoo. yeah we bring some light in this place i like it right, let's see if we can uh, help a melvin here go and boom come on boom Take him out, Melvin, you can do it! And there it is! Awesome! Now, this is a little bit of a weird battle. We've got one guy here, one little shuriken dude, with a whole bunch of cheerleaders. Oh, wait a minute. I think I know what's gonna happen. Oh, no, this gotta be bad, right? This is gonna be so bad. Is he gonna fire really fast? Ooh, that is fast! But guess what? I sure know how to play this game, okay? Let's show this guy what a real shuriken looks like. So I can go over here and give him, boop, one little shuriken just like that. But I can also go back and do this. I can essentially make a big shuriken snake. We're actually gonna supersize a little bit because that's gonna add to the effect. Look at this, right? We can't see anything now. But check this out. Woohoohoohoo! Shirk and snake in three, two, one. Here we go. And. Oh no, they drop. I forgot. I forgot that they drop. Okay, we just gotta keep it going. We just gotta keep it going. <laughs> it's raining, shuriken. Hallelujah. It's raining, shuriken. Oh, well, that was pretty good, right? It's just one more guy. Boop. I said a boop. Hello. There we go. But now. For the most impossible battle of all battles, we have one dude, the king. He's a pretty cool dude, but unfortunately, we are up against quite the army. Now, I don't think the king is gonna survive our nuclear bomb, but the objective is to blow everything away here. So, I have a secret unit to make sure that our team will remain victorious even if the king falls. This is Peter the Painter. And Peter over here is gonna make sure 
that we will survive this battle. So now it's time to create our nuclear bomb. So we are gonna go for the cannonball bomb, which we tested to be the best. I'm just gonna do like a few circles, just like that. Yes! Whoa! <laughs> Very nice. And then we're gonna do a really big bomb right on top. Did that work? <gasps> yes, that worked. Oh, it's beautiful. I can't believe I actually managed to get that right on there. <laughs> wow. Now, all we need are some fireworks to simulate the uh, shockwave, I guess. So we're gonna go all the way around. Just like... Oh, no. Oh, wait. Nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. Just like this. Yes, that's looking pretty good if you ask me. Just a few more, though. Just a few more. Come on. Just a few more. There we go. So now it's time to see if the nuclear bomb that we made using our god powers is any good. We're gonna destroy this impossible battle. Three, two, one. Here we go. Whoa. It's working. It's working. No. Wait, super slow motion. What was that, the king? Um, okay, hold on. Pause it. Okay. Guys, it is super laggy. My whole computer is dying right now. But look at the explosion. No way that this actually worked, though. So let's continue in ultra slow motion. Okay, let's see if that's possible. Okay, that is so laggy. What is happening to the king over here? Look at this guy. Oh my goodness, what's happening to your face? Okay, that's not pretty. That is not pretty at all. This is pretty though. What an explosion. I can feel the heat right over here. Wait, that could also be my computer that's quite literally on fire right now, but it's worth it. All right, let's see if we can continue here. Yes, we can. Wait, why did they survive? Hold the phone. Peter. Peter, are you okay? Oh, Peter the painter. He's okay. No, don't jump up. What are you doing? You survived the... Oh. Guys, F in the chat. This is the saddest thing I've seen in my life. Oh my goodness. But that's okay, guys. Uh, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next Brett Jason 5 video.